Polish, Lithuanian and Ukrainian units training together in Western Ukraine doing exercise rapid trident. This joint venture is nothing new. Exercises like this have been taking place in Ukraine for the last 20 years. Yet the bonds that tie these three countries together became even stronger with the signing this month of an agreement between the defense ministers of Lithuania, Poland and Ukraine, which sees the establishment of a three-way military brigade between the countries. I think it's better later than never. Uh, we started the job for, for creating this brigade, in, I think, in 2008. And now we have we reached the goal. And uh, I hope, as I said, this, this is the expertise and the experience of our uh, each country. It will be very helpful, for, for, first of all, for Ukrainians, but also, also for us. Whilst there has been speculation that the formation of the brigade is in response to Russia's actions in the east of Ukraine, member countries of the brigade are keen to point out that the formation is simply part of a long-standing process of partnership and integration. The idea uh, was born, would say, many years ago. So this is not the answer to the Russian aggression or whosoever aggression to, to any countries or the threat we are afraid of. That was the normal process of the normal military cooperation between countries and to tie our uh, interoperability. For the Ukrainians, it is hoped that the formation of the brigade will bring much needed outside military expertise. Військове керівництво держав побачило перспективи розвитку підрозділів України, Польщі, Литви в тому, щоб створити більш дієздатне чисельністю, мобільністю, технікою, озброєнням, логістикою з'єднання яке могло би адекватно реагувати на виклики, які є в регіоні і які є в світі. Although currently working under the abbreviation Litpol-Yuk Brigade, the final name of the unit is likely to reflect its multinational makeup. For now we've got two uh, different names for brigade. The first one, and probably that will be the final one, is multinational brigade, just multinational brigade. Decisions regarding the deployment of the brigade on international missions will need to be made with the consent of the three member countries, and it is hoped that the brigade will be fully functional within the next six months. For NATO Channel in Lviv, this is Lawrence Cameron.